My name is Stacy Holdeman. I am studying under the School of Applied Health Sciences and Wellness in the Nutrition Department, and my project is uh, called From Laboratory to Collaboratory. I'm working on developing an online lab curriculum based on the existing food science curriculum that the students perform here, at, actually downstairs in the test kitchen. Okay. My name is Christopher Camelli. I'm a second year grad student in exercise physiology. Uh, my project is looking at creating energy deficits and its effects on postprandial lipemia. Uh, postprandial lipemia meaning um, the rise in fat in the blood after you eat a meal. And I'm interested in this because this has special implications for reducing the risk of cardiovascular disease and atherosclerosis. Hi, my name is Trisha Peters. Um, I'm in the Food and Nutrition Master's program here at Ohio University. And my research is on the characterization of the total phenolic and flavonoid content in 12 different varieties of pawpaw, which are a native fruit into, or in the Appalachian region. I am a PhD student uh, in my final year. My research is about uh, understanding how uh, communication, basically uh, language understanding in noise related to our attention and uh, memory. Hi, I'm Lara Householder. I'm getting my master's in food and nutrition sciences in the School of Applied Health Sciences and Wellness. My project focuses on obesity and in obesity not only do you have too much fat tissue, so you have an increase in the quantity of fat, but you also have dysfunctional changes that occur in the tissue. So you get insulin resistance, accelerated remodeling, and inflammation. And those, those dysfunctional changes contribute to whole body metabolic dysregulation and the development of obesity-related diseases such as cardiovascular disease, um, hypertension, diabetes, and certain forms of cancer. Hi, my name is Caitlin Schlosser. I am a graduate student in Child and Family Studies with a Child Life Cognate. For my master's research, I did photographic research in a children's pediatric hospital setting in a oncology and hematology unit. I gave the children cameras, which they used to take pictures throughout their day in the hospital. The next um, day following their picture taking, I met with them and interviewed them about three or four images that they chose to show me.